So this is a partition wall in our entryway. It's not load bearing. It actually just separates what is currently being used as our girls' playroom. So my wife is out of town for three days, and I figure that I would just knock out that wall and put in a 150-gallon fish tank and see if I could have it done before she got home. So the first thing I did was just cut a nice big opening just so I could see what I was dealing with. Um, mostly just those 2 by 2s that were used to attach the drywall for that curved entryway. So just a couple wires here and there that I just have to reroute, but nothing too major. Once the wall was completely out, I uh, brought in the fish tank stand that I had built. I built this out of all 2x4s and 6s because it's going to have to support a lot of weight. It's going to be 150 gallons, so there's going to be a lot of weight to it. So the front side was relatively easy. All I did was re-drywall and then frame in around the fish tank. The back side I actually had to build cabinets. I did this so that the filter would actually be hidden on the bottom underneath the cabinets. And then the top portion, I could just open up and that's where the lights were and that was access just to drop fish food in and, and things like that. So all the access to the top of the tank is in those top cabinets and then all the accessories and everything else are underneath the, the bottom cabinet. Okay, so there it is. Um, actually managed to get it done in the weekend, but the wife was out of town. I think if I had asked her beforehand, like, hey, I want to put on a fish tank, I'm going to knock the wall out, rerun some wiring, and then rehang drywall all around it, she would have looked at me like I was crazy and said, no way. But uh, I kind of took advantage of the opportunity here. I got it in, I got the mess cleaned up, the drywall rehung, so she just comes home and sees the finished product. And it's actually a lot easier for her to take that way. So she actually was pleased. And uh, everything said and done, it turned out pretty good. So thanks for watching and uh, hope you enjoyed the video.